Hi guys, this is another episode on my channel. Um, in this episode I'm going to tell you how to turn an old propane tank into a working crucible for melting copper, aluminum, brass, and everything. So first thing you got to do is you got to get yourself a piece of, well a piece of small metal like this. I forget what size this is, but it's really small and then I cut it with my angle grinder. You cut that slot in it. And then I have this thing right here. And what you do with this is when you're first about to to cut to work on this, you stick this down there and try to drain make sure there's no propane. If you don't hear a sizzling sound or smell anything, that means there's definitely none left in there that's gonna come out at you when you do this. Next step, you're, there's this little valve right here. That's the emergency release valve. You stick the thing down here, and you're gonna try to open that. Sometimes it doesn't want to come. Okay, there we go. We got the valve out. There's a little valve in there. Hold on to this. You can do some neat stuff with this emergency release valve. Okay, next up, we're going to go over to um, to the hose. Sorry about that. So we got it right here. Now, there's definitely nothing in there right now. So what you can do, you can take a drill bit, not this one. Take this little other drill bit. Battery's almost dead. Okay, there you go. You got that drilled out a little bit. And this is just some water can drain down in there. Okay, you're going to try to fill that up with water. I'm just going to flush out all that propane that's in there. I'm going to try to drill another hole in the other side. There are plenty of water on there. Oops, scan on my camera. Okay, you're through now. So you're just gonna keep filling this up with water. You can see the propane bubbling out of there. There's propane and water and oxygen. Okay, this is almost full.
You have to come with both. Okay. So now that that's full, she's gonna want to maybe shake this. We're going to go into my workshop. Sorry that this is such a long video. I don't really know how to cut on and off while I'm recording yet, but uh, I'll figure it out eventually. Okay, now that we're in here, so to speak. this stuff out of the way. Some of my, some of my fireworks, some of my radiation stuff. Whoa. Just a second, sorry to see. Okay, so you're just gonna cut off the top, don't worry, there's nothing in the road. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're just going to dump out all that, all that water, a lot of metal dust in it now. Just going to dump that. Now you got a crucible. Good as new. I mean, well, never mind. Um, anyway, you can use this for melting any kind of metal you can think of if your forge can handle it. And uh, if it's not too hot, that's going to melt this. I've melted a couple of these actually. But, uh, this looks like it'll work pretty good. You might want to watch out for this little brass, or this little bronze thing in there where they attach that. They just brazed it. That could, uh, that could melt and then you could have a problem. But, it should be good for for small jobs and stuff. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe. This is the Soviet Blacksmith. Make sure to tell your friends. Bye. Das Vidanya. <laughs>